Good day, Lords and Ladies, and welcome back to Battle Brothers Mikon tonight. As we continue our ever going quest, right, so that's done. We head off down here. Start taking out the orcs. The destroy locations are controlled by orcs. The item you get from that is okay. I will say that some of the things I wish this game did is that, for these, for example, for the amount of effort you go for to get these items, it would be nicer if it had a bit more general impact. So what are we looking at? A few orc young, a single berserker, and a few warriors. Party set up. Yeah, these guys can take it without too much issue. To be honest, I'm tempted to just put in some of my less um, level dudes, to be honest. Uh, not him, he's too low. Because some of these guys really do need to be leveled. Um, and I have a good enough backline that I'm not overly concerned. The Berserk is going to be annoying. I'm not going to lie. So, what are we looking at? Okay, he's not got a great weapon, which isn't too bad. There's seven of them. Three warriors. Three young and a Berserker. So let's hold off and bait the Berserker out. And we'll kill him off first. He's going to be the he's going to be one of the early main threats. Okay. Problem is, if he gets to our line, we're going to have serious issues. So. Get that up. Orc warriors. A couple of them. There's one with an axe, which is worrying. Okay, we've got a couple of good hits in. Um, can't hit him this turn, so let's delay and see where the berserker goes. There he goes, okay. That was bad. Can't allow him to live, so he's going to have to die. Hold off. With the Berserk dead, we'll just hold the line for a moment. And see where their warriors go. This is going to be fun. So they're going up there. Okay. He can't do anything. Now we've got to worry about these two warriors here. We'll keep hitting him to get rid of his ability to hit us. And we do the same with this, along with him. Delay, smack him. Break him if possible. He's blocking a lot of my hits. Keep that up, because he's got to come. Ch oh, he's coming all the way. He's going up there, is he? Okay. Plan B it is. Adrenaline. Overhead chop. More adrenaline. Give him penalties. Nerf this guy's 
our um, ability to, to hit us with the overwhelm ability. And then block. If we kill him... If we kill him, it would be useful. Okay, so he's pushing into our line again. We can go up there to support. Don't really need to worry about you anymore. You get up here. Yeah, countered. Well done. Out of arrows, not great. One thing I will have, I will say is that there's now a lack of unbehold missions for me at the moment because I cannot find them anywhere. All right, he died, so he tries to stun me. We finish him off. Right. Get that. Lots of dodgy supplies, which we don't really need. Um, tools are okay. Ammunition is getting a bit low. That being stated, how's our supply? How's our like general stats looking? Okay, but we've got a lot of dodgy meats, which is going to go off. Which I don't really care about. I took out one encampment. What's this one? Some berserkers, some young. This may be a bit more challenging. Berserkers are berserkers hit way above their hit. Okay, sorry. Um, berserkers normally hit very um, much higher above their weight class than um, other units. Well, other orc units, I should say. Um, it's annoying, personally. Um, put him in. Ah, actually, he should be okay. Got a good enough lineup. Gonna have him so he can buff our morale. He's not leveled up yet, so we'll have him in as well. Right, okay. Yeah, I find Orc Berserkers to be massively Orc Warlords, like one of the nastiest enemies in the game. Because they have those, which are great axes, which are absolutely monstrous. And they will absolutely mess us up if they hit us. So we're going to try and kill them as quickly as possible. Right. They missed, but that doesn't mean much. Target priorities. Right, that orc is in the line. We'll kill him, him off, get a damage boost, shoot him. Start gutting these guys. Um, they got armor, which sucks. Because he's going to come right in there. Right. 
And do I do adrenaline now? Because these guys got to charge. Ugh, no, not worth it. Where's this one? On the... He's going to do that. Okay. Because that chain's going to be nasty. do this, it's a risk. Okay, leave him alive. He's got a broken nose and almost dead. He's falling back. Or not. But you can see what I mean by orcs. Right. Like one hit almost killed him. I mean, he wasn't wearing the best helmet, arguably, but still. Like, Orc Berserkers are always overpowered. Especially on the higher difficulty settings, I find. Because they get stronger the more people they kill. And because the RNG seems to favour the AI on higher difficulty less settings. It can get pretty dicey. Right, so how badly was he... Like, he was wearing... Uh, he wasn't wearing a fantastic helmet, to be honest. Um, I could have given him something better than that. Do I have something better than that? Yeah, there we go. Okay. Rubbish. Boost that. Boost health. He's got one perk left and it's maxed. I will grab nine lies for him because nine lies is useful. Okay, so you're out. We'll shove you in for now. You're, you're you're disappointed. Fine, you can go in. Right. Tools. All that stuff is okay. All hunters. Nothing to be particularly worried about. But as you can see. The issue with Orc Berserkers, for those of you who don't know about their ability, is that they the more people they kill, the stronger they become, and the stronger their stats become. Um, which means that they can really quickly snowball. Um, and they're the, I believe they're one of the few Orc... I think Orc Warlords have the same ability as the Berserker. Um, but anyway, it's not a nice ability. It's relatively brutal, because if you're not careful, it will just annihilate your whole party. And there isn't much that you can do to stop it, I have found. Um, it's one of those abilities... You just have to kill them as quickly as possible. They don't have fantastic morale. That's the one thing I will say about orcs, is that their morale is rather shoddy. Um, well, orc berserker's morale is rather shoddy, which means that you can very quickly just, like, annihilate them. Um... Yeah, we'll show that. Um, so that's the easiest way so I just focus fire them down. Um, dedicated. Ooh, that's nice. Does anybody... Nah, I mean, I've got enough people with norm with good enough kit. I don't need it, to be honest. Yeah, don't need it. Um, no healers. Anyone who could do with a level up. 
chuck some money at them. Where's my pole and him? So I want to get them up. Him, I don't care about. The low level guys. At the end of the day, they're there really just to buffer them more than anything else. Uh, yeah, I'll grab that. See, this is the thing I like. If you look at the heavy crossbow compared to, say, the warbow, which is 35 damage ignores armor and 60% of damage effective against armor, um, they're much better at dealing with armored foes, which they should be. They're also much better against the undead. Crossbows have now a increased damage output versus undead compared to other weapons, or other ranged weapons, which is nice. Um, okay, so he's up. Fine. Join us for a campfire tonight. Yeah, yeah, just usual fluff, nothing particularly of use. One thing I would recommend though is that I wouldn't have the perma destruction on. It's unrealistic to a certain extent because in the real world, places like this would get resettled relatively quickly as refugees and stuff and various travelling groups, people would move into an area and settle it. Um, to, so I have permadestruction. I do it because permanently... Oh, I, I do it out of habit more than anything else. Right, do we want to go in night time? I might... No, I was going to go in and we are going to go in at night, which is not something I want to do. So we're just going to wander around for a second. We have the food to do it, so it shouldn't take us too long. Um... And as soon as day comes, there's some orcs. Lovely orcs, which means there's probably another base operations. Right, let's go and deal with them. Some warriors, a single berserk, and some young. Right, so... Uh, I need him more than anything else. Yeah, I'll keep him. I mean, if he survives, he survives. He should be able to handle a bit of orc combat. And I have the great swordsman there to, to help him out if needs be. So, what are we looking at? Four orc warriors. Uh, that's not great. And we've got a... Um, berserker floating about somewhere. There he is. Yeah, no great weapons, so it's not the end of the world. The four orc warriors, though, is going to be nasty. Finish him off to get the damage boost. And then we can really start laying into them. that up. Uh, the three of them are armed with orc axes though, which are la nasty. Um, the warriors are. So that's something we're going to have to be careful of. So if we're not careful, they'll swarm us. Oh, just to your berserker down, as always. Because he'll tank a lot of damage if we're not careful. Right. Dang. Now but they've stunned a lot of my men. I need to kill that berserker. You're going to have to keep this up for a second, unfortunately. Because he's coming right down the middle. I see what you're trying to do.
hold in reserve and you keep that up because you're going to need it. So you're going to be fighting and fighting an orc, fighting an orc straight on. And you just shot me a bunch of times. Great. I'm going to pummel his morat. Uh, I might lose him if I'm not careful. Really? Okay. Destroyer's armor. They're going to try and flank, which is not something I want them to do. They stunned locked me. Great. This is not going well. Break him. You're going to tank. You're going to block. That's not great. But she's going to come around here. my back line. Oh, you need to die. He blocked that, which was good. Give him penalties. Doubt this will be effective against him. Nope. This is gonna suck if I don't to handle this quickly. You're out of ammo. Get out your pike. This is going to suck. He's into my back line. Okay, he broke. Adrenaline next turn. We need to give him a way out. Stab him. How's his... Oh, his gear is looking bad. Okay. Right. Okay, so we need to get that up. Pummel him a bit more. Beating him because we need to beat him like no one's business. Right. Oh, he's still holding. Thank goodness for that. Who? Man, that was a nasty fight.
indeed. Right, we took care of that. I'm going to have that here, folks. If you've liked, please press the like button. If you subscribe, please press the subscription button. You can follow me on Twitter. You can follow me on Steam. You can leave a comment in the comment section. I'll get back in contact with you. I've been Cornish Knight, and this has been Battle Brothers Warriors North, and I shall see you all again next time. Goodbye.